Many Gcams nowadays I found that are of approximately 400 to 500 megabytes, but this Gcam which is quite underrated, it's less than 100 MB. It's around 70 MB, which is so good and having all the useful features which you need in a Gcam. Also including that, we have a lot of features including this. It's been a long time since I made a video on any Gcam. As you can see, it also brings you the watermark, so that's quite impressive here. In this video, we are going to talk about this Gcam here, which the link is already available in the description. And this Gcam is LMC. The name is LMC, of course. And you can see, you can choose a watermark in case you want to. A lot of watermark options are there. You can use LMC, Lika, etc, etc. We can see here, if I choose this, if I choose this, check it out. You can see, if I choose this Lika watermark here, it's working perfectly fine here most of the devices uh, is this definitely should work on your device too with the latest android version or whichever you are you are using right now you can see you can choose up to 4k 60 fps and i'm not exactly sure if your device supports 8k and if it works there for or sure or not one of my favorite features is video stabilization which works flawlessly you will definitely notice a major difference as compared to other gcams on a device in the terms of quality i'm not exactly sure because if you use any other gcam things could be different in your case astrophotography mode is also there i guess for most of the devices this gcam should work because it's lightweight and this is gcam by lmc it brings you all the features which you need a lot of tweaks are already included if you know what you are doing that could be useful for you but if you don't know i will not suggest you to change any settings here that could decrease the value or decrease the image quality depends on which you have what have you done so far as you can see a lot of options are there regarding lmc tweaks third party gallery option is there we have the option for portrait a lot of options to customize almost everything what you need for example you can change the hdr model interface etc etc and all the other gcam features are also present here very simple things but quite useful if you want to know more about this gcam you can download and install it on your device link is already available in the description so make sure to check it out thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one